Hey y'all wanted to shoot a video to answer a question that I get asked all the time and that is why do you have a beard? Why have the beard? Why did you grow a beard? Um, and so the first answer to be to be really honest like I was in the military and in the military I just shave every single day. And so when I got out of the military I was like shavings for the birds man I'm done with that I don't want to shave anymore. Um, shaving is expensive. Uh, there was no like Dollar Shave Club or whatever that thing is. We had to go, you had to go buy the Gillette Mach 12 razors or whatever they are. And I feel like I had to like sell a kidney on the black market to pay for those things. So I uh, stopped when I got out of the military. I've had facial hair since then. So since 2007. Um, I say facial hair, not a beard, because I went through some really unfortunate stages where I wish a good friend would have intervened and told me I look crazy. Uh, there was an unfortunate goatee stage. Uh, there was a, a, a really unfortunate uh, handlebar, like chin strap. No, that's what it's called, chin strap. Handlebars are actually pretty cool. Uh, chin strap stage, like real bad, y'all. And then uh, finally, I just started to let it grow. And so this is, I don't know, probably seven-ish months of growth. Um, I trim it fairly regularly just to try to keep it looking somewhat manageable and not all poofy and crazy. Um, so that's first reason. Second reason, uh, y'all, I look like a 12-year-old boy without, uh, without a beard. And um, my wife would prefer that I not look like a 12 year old boy. So I have a beard. And so when there's guys who are like, man, hot, man, what do you do to get your wife to let you have a beard and deal with that and everything? And I'm like, you look like a 12 year old boy without it. And then she's uh, fairly fond of it, to be honest. And then the third reason is um, years ago, I found this article. And uh, this article, they had done all this research on, um, they had pulled like all these women and asked them, uh, what do you think about men with beards? Do you like men with beards or without beards? And what they found by and large was that women in general find men with beards less attractive, uh, but more fatherly and wise. And so I, I told my wife, like, that's exactly what you want women to think of me. You don't want them thinking I'm attractive. You want them thinking I'm unattractive and wise. And so, yeah, those are the three reasons for me. All right, I forgot. There's another reason. How can I forget this, man? Charles Spurgeon, the Spurge. Uh, he's a theologian, one of my favorite pastors, uh, favorite guys to read. He lived in the 1800s and he's got this quote where he says, growing a beard is a habit most natural, uh, manly, scriptural, and beneficial. And I remember reading that and being like, man, the Spurge knows what he's talking about. And so that's a fourth reason, man. Charles Spurgeon has that quote where I was like, yeah, that's totally true. So beards, let it grow, let it flow. Gents, I hope y'all have a good day. Catch you soon.